Morning. Good evening. Good afternoon, everyone. Hope everyone's well. Hope everyone's staying safe. Hope everyone's having an awesome day and all that jazz. Um, little video I'm just going to put together. Um, I wasn't going to do a video this evening. Uh, the next video I was going to do was actually inspecting the bees. But I thought, whilst it's on my mind, it's something that should be said. So I thought I'd get it going. I was going to do this as a live stream. Um, I was going to make making up some sugar feed, some sugar syrup for the bees. And I was going to do a little live feed and all that sort of stuff. But unfortunately, I, what I didn't want to happen is it turned into a bit of a rant. And um, so I was a bit worried that if I did a live, it might turn that way. But at least this way I can kind of think about what I'm going to say before I say it. Um, if you want to watch a, a rant, go and watch my YouTube video when I put a bit of a rant about YouTube. But um, what I'm going to do today, what I just want to talk about today is, um, and before I start, I paint this here as well. This isn't me grumbling as well. This is a this is something that I chose to do and it's something that I love doing. But I think it's something that, especially as a new beekeeper, you've got to try and bear in mind. Or if you're a beekeeper like myself that wants to grow and you need to bear this in mind. So I I got up this morning about half past five. I then, after sorting out the animals that we've got, went off and did a 10 hour shift um, on my day job. Um, came home after that, sort of looked after the kids, sort of after the kids, um, did the housework, sort of the animals and all that sort of stuff. It's now nine o'clock at night, just gone past nine o'clock at night. And the last thing that I wanted to do at nine o'clock tonight was make sugar food, sugar syrup for the bees. I wanted to put on some rubbish on the telly and fall asleep. However, that's not possible because jobs have got to be done. And you do your jobs when you've got time to do them, be it at five o'clock in the morning or nine o'clock at night, you, you, you take, you, you grab the time to do things when you can. And what I think needs to be said and what I think new beekeepers especially need to understand is that when you are beekeeping, it isn't just visiting the hive. One of my friends at work said today, she said, she said how long do you, do you spend doing your bees? I said, well, from just doing the bees, like checking them over and stuff like that, about an hour, hour and a bit. Um, but what, isn't really always thought about is the time that it takes beekeepers behind the scenes of you know the normal bee stuff what they're doing making frames be it making boxes be it repairing boxes be it doing the sugar syrup be it preparing pollen patties anything like that the things that don't normally get seen and if you're a new beekeeper you need to keep in mind that it all takes time there is a lot of work to do and not always enough hours in the day. And so when it gets to about nine, ten o'clock and you want to put your feet up and do nothing, you just need to keep in the back of your mind saying that, you you know, these animals, these bees, these girls, they depend on you to to get them through sometimes. Like now, I said, if they're going to need feed, I need to make feed, I need to give it to the girls. You know, you can't skimp on that. So just be prepared that it isn't always get up, go into the bees, come home, job done. There is a lot of work behind the scenes and there's a lot of things you need to be doing with the bees as well. So that's that's pretty much all I wanted to say really. I said, if you're um if you're new beekeeping, if you're beekeeper that wants that wants to grow and things like that, just remember I said it's everything takes time. The more beehives you've got, the longer it takes. And I'm up to six hives at the moment, and like I said, I'm trying to squeeze in a few minutes when I can. And you just need to remember that sometimes you don't want to you know you don't want to carry on you don't want to get up and you don't want to go and make the bee food you don't want to do this that and the other but you have to you just bear that in mind so what i really want to say uh, on that front um whilst we're here i will mention as well um i've just checked over the subscribers we're up to about 230 ish subscribers now so thank you so much um our yearly target was 250 so if we can make 250 before uh before six months into the year that'll be fantastic so um Massive appreciation to everyone that's, that's, that's stuck with me, that's subscribed and all that sort of stuff. I'm going to crack on with making some bee food and um, we'll go from there. So, um, quick video. Not a rant, just something to take on board. So, take care of yourself. All the best to you. Bye-bye.